Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math. And today, we're going to learn about solving rational equations. And we're going to solve this equation, and remember to check our extraneous solutions. So, or four extraneous solutions. So, if I was given this equation, 3m squared is equal to m minus 4 over 3m squared plus 2 over 3m squared. Okay. Well, First thing I'm looking at here, I see a lot of fractions, and uh, what I want to do is see if I can combine these two fractions. So I'm going to combine them here. So 3 over m squared is equal to, since they have the same base, I can add them together, keep them that same base, 3m squared. And the numerator is m minus 4 plus 2. Okay? Now we can simplify that when we have, um, what is it, 3 over m squared here is equal to uh, negative 4, or minus 4 plus 2 is minus 2, so m of minus 2 over 3m squared here. <clears throat> so my next step is I can cross multiply, okay? But what I'm going to do is, well, I'm going to cross multiply in a sense, but in reality I could just multiply, you, I mean, you can cross multiply, but I know if I multiply the 3m squared to both sides here, the n squares are going to cancel, so I'm going to multiply both sides by 3m squared. And what that does is cancels the 3m squareds right there, and then these m squareds will cancel, leaving me with just a 9 on the left is equal to m minus 2. Okay? So then I'm going to add a 2 to both sides, give me 11 equals m, rewrite it so m comes first, and m equals 11, and there we have our answer. But we need to check it now, check for our extraneous solution. So here's my little check here, I'll fit it right there, check. I'm going to plug, I'll, oh, I'll rewrite the whole thing. 3. Uh, m squared equals m minus 4 over 3m squared. Let's plug 11 in for m. 3 over 11 squared equals 11 minus 4 over 3 times 11 squared. Okay, well, here, here's a little trick, ready? So if you don't know what 11 squared is, that's fine, okay? Uh, it's 121, but so if I have 3 over uh, 121, I want to say in a second you'll see is, uh, watch it. so 11 minus 4 uh, would give me, uh, I can't add right now, oh my goodness, drawing a blank, drawing a blank there, 11 minus 4, oh, we forgot the other parts here, no wonder, I'm like, this isn't going to work, 3m squared here, and then we have plus 2 over 3 times 11 squared, fantastic, so, uh, so now we have 11 minus 4, which is a 7, right, uh, or we can, yeah, 7 over uh, 3 times 11, which is 121, plus uh, 2 over 3 times 121, 11 squared. Now, the 11, these are the same base, we can combine them together. 3 over 121 is equal to uh, 9 over 3 times 121, right? 7 plus 2 is 9. And then from there, 9 divided by 3 comes out to be 3 up top. So we have 3 over 121 equals 3 over 121. They're equal. What I was saying, now it's kind of small, hopefully you can see that. Okay, what I was saying about the 11 squared and leaving it like that is we didn't actually have to distribute the 3 times 121. I never, I like to keep it separate sometimes if I know if I'm going to cancel it out. And since I saw 11 squared there and a lot of 11 squared, I probably could have just left 11 squared and saw that they were the same, right? It would have been 3 over 11 squared equals 3 over 11 squared. Either way, we confirmed m equals 11. So let's recap, we're given our, our function here, our equation, sorry, and then uh, what I need to do is I combined uh, the fractions here on the right because of the same base, and then uh, what I did was simplify up top, giving me m minus 2 over 3m squared on the right, and 3 over m squared on the left. I multiply on both sides by 3m squared, giving me 9 on the left and m minus 2 on the right, then I solved for m and got m equals 11. I plugged it back in it and made sure, eventually realized, write the whole equation, right? I'll plug 11 in for m. Simplified, 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 kept everything on both sides. Got that 3 over 121 was equal to 3 over 21. 121, fantastic. Both left and right sides were equal. Great. Confirming that our final answer is m equals 11.